Hi, this is Jason from the QuickBooks team. Once you have QuickBooks payments, you can take payments directly from your customers. Let's go over how to add a payment option to an invoice and how your customer can pay you online. Then we'll show you how to find out info on all the deposits you receive from QuickBooks payments, where you can set up instant deposits to get your money faster if you want, and what you need to do to keep your books accurate. Finally, we'll show you some other videos where you can learn how to use QuickBooks Payments to take mobile payments, issue payment links, and schedule recurring payments. If you still need to sign up for QuickBooks Payments, you can learn how to do that here. First, let's add a Pay Online option to an invoice. Select New and Invoice. Make sure your payment options are turned on. If they are, you'll see them here. If not, go to Payment Methods and toggle on the payment methods you want to offer your customer. Then fill out your invoice. If you need help filling out the invoice, this other video has more details. When you're done, send it to your customer. Your customer will receive an email with a link to pay your invoice using any of the payment methods you selected. Go to Deposits to see more info about the payments you are receiving. Each day, QuickBooks Payments combines all the payments that are processed that day into a single deposit. For each deposit, you'll see information like how many transactions were in the batched deposit and how much you paid in fees. Select the deposit and you'll see more information like the transactions QuickBooks deposited together, including who made the payment and how they paid you. Transactions processed by QuickBooks Payments can take a few days to show up in your bank account. If you've charged customers for something recently and QuickBooks hasn't deposited it yet, you can receive it as an instant deposit for an additional fee. When the money hits your bank account, you'll see your deposit in your transactions feed. Usually QuickBooks auto matches your bank transactions with payments, so you don't need to take any action. QuickBooks does it all for you. If you see that the transactions weren't automatically matched, you may need to turn on auto matching. Check out this video to learn about that. If sales don't automatically match to deposits after you turn on automatic matching, select match to match the transaction with a bank deposit yourself. You can also use QuickBooks Payments to take payments from your phone using our card reader. Create and send out one-time payment links that you can send or text to customers. And schedule recurring payments with AutoPay. These videos will show you how.